All right, it's time for another test. So previously we had done a hot coffee test in these tumblers. Now it's time to do a cold drink test. On the left here we have the Ozark Trail from Walmart. You can get it for about seven bucks. All the other videos on YouTube report similar results to the Yeti, so you can pretty much sub the Yeti in it. Next we have the Thermos King model tumbler. Pick it up for about 25 bucks on Amazon. This one's just a cheap freebie got from a promotional item. Pretty much everyone has one of those, I imagine. And just an open coffee mug. So I filled them up with 25 pieces of ice, about that size. And then filled them up with 10 ounces of water to simulate a cold drink. So we're just gonna, we're not gonna check in or check temperatures or anything. We're just gonna check in every time one drops off. Since the Ozark Trail one has an open mouth and it can't be closed, Whereas the thermos one can be closed, I'm going to go ahead and leave the thermos one open. Next, this one, also you can open and close it. We're going to leave it open since the Ozark Trail one can't be. And then the coffee mug's obviously open. So we'll check in once the, uh, I suspect the coffee mug will drop out first. So we're about an hour and 40 minutes in. It looks like the coffee mug, no ice remaining, so it's out of there. Just we'll just peek on everything else. All right, we'll check in when the next one drops off. Well, another one has ended. It's all water now. The cheap freebie tumbler, all out of ice. It's just water. We're right at about three hours in. I mean, almost exactly. Just a few minutes shy. And just we'll check on the other two. Ice keeps to looking real big. Same with the Ozark Trail. We'll see which one of them makes it. Well, here we are. Test is all over, and the winner is the Thermos. So, right at 12 hours in, the last piece of ice melted in the Ozark Trail cup. The thermos still has a few in there. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. About seven pieces left in the thermos. So even though it's meant for hot drinks, it beats the uh, Ozark Trail and cold drinks as well. I mean, Ozark Trail still lasted 12 hours and that the cheap generic one lasted just under three hours. I mean, four times as long. Who keeps it? drink on ice for 12 hours. You don't, you drink it. Anyway, both phenomenal tumblers or ramblers, whatever you want to call it, great cups. Can't go wrong either way. Again, check out my other videos. I have a hot coffee test in these same tumblers. And I also have some of the Ozark Trail ice cooler tests. I got an ice test coming up on that. So, and I also have a Yeti cooler test as well. So check those out. If you like them, leave comments. If you don't, let me know why. And if you want me to do a test on anything else, again, leave that in the comments. Thanks for watching.